Greetings YouTube, welcome, this is yet another video tutorial about PHP programming language. In this video we will use HTML and CSS to make a tag cloud. So let's get to it, first we create our index.php file, okay, like so. You might be wondering how can I write all of this line in a, in a single motion? Well this is just a, a, a glimpse of uh, some of Vim magic here. So first, we connect to our database, like so. A simple PDO connection, and we will use the wallpapers database. In this database, we have three tables, but the only tables that we'll work with is the tags table and the wallpapers tags table. In this table, we have a one-to-many relationship. For every ID of a wallpaper, we have many tags, and the tags can repeat for 711 here and 711 here as example is a tag that is repeated and this repetition it will help, help us to create our tag cloud after connecting to our database we will query some data we will limit our rows to 30 we will select the tag name and the count of the tag id as the weight this weight later will decide our font size a simple join uh, query here we will join the tags table and the wallpapers tags table but the key word here is group by tag id when we group by, by the tag id we will get the count of how many times it has been repeated and simply enough we will get the we will fetch the data into our array here tags here in the body another PHP segment here okay let's get uh, we will have this variable here starting font size it will be 10 you may consider it as the minimum font size and this factor is a uh, 0 0.4 it, it is uh, just to minimize the font for a large weight that we select we will, you will see this uh, in a moment so we will make create our div here it's a container for our for our cloud tags here i call it its class cloud div for each element in our array here i will get the weight divided by 100 and multiply it by the factor to minimize its value here by 0 0.4 and the final font size will will be the starting font size plus this x that will round here Simple enough, we echo a an, an anchor here and a span that will have the font size variable depending on the weight here and slash div. Let's try this. Okay. In our index. Good. As you can see, we have many words here that have um, a dif different font sizes that's great but still not good enough we will add some CS CSS here so in our head HTML not our head so this is our style the cloud div will have a width of 50% we, it will have element centered and the cloud tag it has a padding of zero padding right five uh, five pixels vertical align center and no wrap well okay let's see the effect of this good as you can see here things are lit, uh, appearing at little a little bit good than before but there is a single problem here the if, uh, the tag cloud does not appear to be dynamic because it is is showing the same thing even if we reload the page to fix this we will add a later uh, the last element of our tutorial here is a way to make it a little bit random to shuffle the tags after we get them from our database so we take the array tags and we take, we take the keys from this array we shuffle them and then for every key we take its first its uh, original value and save it to a new 
array that's called it new this array will be shuff a shuffled version of the original keys by array and after this for each loop we will get uh, the new array and save it uh, again to our original array let's see this as you can see the tag cloud changes after every reload the effect of the value of our factor here if we increase the value of the factor like 0 0.9 you might see that the font overall change it's it's a little bigger here okay thank you very much for watching i hope you may find this interesting and see you in another video sometimes later thank you for watching and if you like this content please subscribe to my channel